welcome back in the kitchen with Chef Ricardo cooking program guys today we're going to show you how you can make yourself a lovely nice even Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday right back to Sunday again a lovely stew chicken at home is just perfect right to the point right to the dot this chicken is good and enjoy it guys hopefully you will love nice the one. recipe so subscribe to you the extra thank you so much remember we are the same guys our dishes guys so very important leave your comments anyway Basically, remember you can get a copy of the cooking book and link below you can click on the link and it takes streams where you can get a book so this price is just all basic of price guys which we're going to use really today just amazing to make so our enjoy best thank you so much hopefully you're going to make some lovely shoe chicken and this is the seasoning which you're going to use inside of it so right here guys i'm going to show you something we got chicken seasoning all-purpose seasoning everyday seasoning vegetable seasoning paprika and some all-purpose seasoning right over here we have some natural seasoning chopped up garlic white onion spring onion and some fresh thyme Right over here we have 3 kilos of chicken cut up into some curry style As you can see, very small And we got some browning which we're gonna also use inside of it So this is all of my ingredients which we're gonna use today to make our best stew chicken Hopefully you enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the YouTube channel Thank you so much for watching the cooking program guys Right over here we have a big medium sized pot but we're going to get to that pie so let's marinate the chicken When you marinate your chicken put it down to soak for 2 hours or you marinate it from the day before Enjoy it, thank you so much So that's the chicken So the first thing we're going to do put 2 tablespoons of vegetable oil and some browning 2 tablespoons of browning Nice one. Put some sweet chili sauce if you have any or some ketchup, roughly three tablespoon. All of your seasoning. Quart, three quart of your natural seasoning, and leave some for the pot. All right, guys. Nice one. Then put on the gloves and marinate the chicken just like this. This is a lovely stew chicken. And a stew chicken can serve with rice, anything you like. And you can do this from the day before. Lovely. So you can put down this for two hours for it to soak, or you can do this from the day before. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna put down this for two hours for it to soak. Enjoy the recipe. So now it's two hours since I've been soaking my chicken. This is the big pot which you're gonna use. It's a massive pot, guys, and first of all. Let's put two, a teaspoon of vegetable oil. Um, make sure you pack a little bit warm first, roughly about two seconds, and a medium sized beet. Then put all of your rest of the veg, garlic, spring onion, and some thyme. Let's promote a second and a medium sized meat. Then put your chicken in. Give it a stir. You can see all the chicken looking so lovely so far. Next thing, cover it on a medium sized heat and wait for it to sweat. 
for roughly about 10 to 15 minutes. So, if you add your extra veg to your stew chicken, guys, and I'm telling you, this is very important for your stew chicken. Basically, I just peel one medium potato, one medium carrot, and I just simply cut them into this, very small, into some dices. Right over here, I have some mixed pepper, red, green, and gold. And right here, I have some white, more extra white onion, which I'm going to add towards it also. That's all of your veg, extra veg which you're going to have to eat now. It's about 15 minutes now um, since I've been cooking it. Spraying this own juice. So let's take a look at it. Big surprise, guys. Nice. So right here, as you can see, the street chicken is lovely inside of the pot. Now we're going to add our extra veg just to make it start to cook inside of it. Nice one. And remember, don't cut your veg on too big. Cut them very, very small. And I didn't have any salt because most of those seasoned do uh, salt. But basically what I'm going to do, I'm just going to add a little bit of boiling water to it. Just a little pinch, not too much. And now we're going to leave it for another 10 minutes and then we're going to take a look at it. as I can see right over here this is finished now so all you need to do is just leave it to cook for roughly until you see the veg them cook and it turn on to us nice lovely gravy like this turn it on at a medium size eat after and I want to say something to you honestly guys I did not add any more like other seasoning or anything else to eat all I did just like what I did inside of the video that's all I did to this. I didn't after, I didn't put anything else in it. All I did is just get it marinated, put it on for two hours, and simply basically cook it just like this. All I did is just add the extra veg to it and a little bit of water. Just all I did. Because all of those seasoning do got salt inside of it. I don't need to add anything else to it and the browning and everything. So basically now guys, this is finished and this looking so lovely and fantastic but after 10 minutes and you see it boil up you need to turn on your stove for another five more minutes to leave it for it to simmer and that's the best way to cook your brown stream chicken at home hopefully you will enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the youtube channel thank you so much for watching my cooking program in the kitchen with chef ricardo we have a lot more recipe coming up for you we know that you might have stew chicken on the YouTube, but a lot of people still ask. And I always, if you have any question, request it. I will definitely make it for you. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.